And topping our health chaos today, a recent study finds that women treated for breast cancer may age a little faster than their cancer-free counterparts. Dr. Carmen Kalfa, a breast medical oncologist with Sylvester Comprehensive Cancer Center, says NIH researchers wanted to find out if one particular type of therapy was perhaps more impactful on biological aging than others, and looked at specific treatment regimens, including things like surgery, chemotherapy, radiation, and hormonal therapy. Investigators found that radiation did have the biggest impact on biological aging. So that's an interesting finding because when you think about radiation, it's not really a systemic treatment. It's not gone to every single part of your body. It's given in a local regional way, usually to the breast and or the lymph nodes around. And it's an interesting finding. You will say, well, how can a local regional treatment actually affect something systemically, such a biological aging process? And I think we're going to learn more with more research that is going to happen. And Dr. Kalfa says the findings should not in any way lead women to abandon that particular treatment option because regardless of biological aging, she says radiation, along with other therapies, saves and extends life, which of course is the ultimate goal in treating breast cancer. And another new study is shedding some light on how allergies tend to develop and progress in children. Looking at medical records for more than 20,000 kids over a 21-year period, researchers found that children diagnosed with eczema as babies often later were allergic and had allergic reactions to food and pollen. Experts say the findings could give doctors and parents some clues about the link between skin conditions and sensitivities to other factors.